of this type of quarterback in the air raid offense that they have at TSU. And there you see it already, just straight on the quarterback draw, first down yardage, past the 40-yard line. They have to be able to protect and, and get penetration uh, into the second level. Empty backfield, body pressured, and he's taken down for the sack. Mason Richards. Start with three receivers out wide, and Ani keeps it himself on the read option. He's got some room before he's tripped up at the 50. On field goals, will attempt a 43-yarder. He's got it up, and it's good. Body over the middle has a man who takes a hit right at the marker. Appreciate you calling it a toss. It was a toss. It's a cannon. Speaking of a cannon, Io Day just shot out of one. Inside the 30, down to the 10, into the end zone. 59 yards for Iowa Day -E in North Texas. Finds pay dirt. Third down and nine. They go to the play action. Ani has Ward again. Damon Ward Jr. into enemy territory in first down yardage. And he is instilling the discipline of that Division I program in these guys in that spread offense. Third down, Austin ani has got a man in the end zone. Jamori Macklin finds his way into the secondary and he dances his way into the end zone. He's up by two scores again. And Austin Ani dropping a dime. Tommy Bush and Jair Shorter on that side of the formation. Back to the ground, big hole. Iowa Day, he had a 59-yard touchdown run earlier, and he takes this one all the way inside the 35-yard line. Loves to move those guys out of the trenches. They go to the play action. There's Jair Shorter. Made a man miss, and he's into the end zone. His first touchdown since returning from an ACL injury last year. Made his return last week, and he makes his return to the end zone this week. The second, Jair Shorter in his second game back finds the end zone for the Mean Green. Body pressured off the right side, but he still completes it for a first down over the middle. And he has Mason Richards coming down on him, and he stands in the, I think it is now, here in Denton. Body off balance throw, finds another man. It's Trenton Leary, the freshman, in the shotgun with four receivers. Steps up into the pocket, avoids the pressure, delivers it, bouncing off of a receiver and finding A.J. Bennett in the back of the end zone for a Tiger touchdown. Hand of one receiver into the hand of another. A.J. Bennett with a receiving touchdown. The Tiger. Find a receiver down the field, basically in a scramble drill. Near side has a wide open Roderick Burns. Burns inside the 30, off to the races. He'll find the end zone. 70 yards out, it's the longest play of the North Texas season for Roderick Burns and his first touchdown of the new year. From a day he, but this one right here from Burns and just a simple seam route taken to the house. Zadaway goes back to the ground, catches the edge, spins up field, lays a bow into his defender and gets down to the three yard line. Attaway, another shot. Doesn't miss this time. Into the end zone. Attaway extends the North Texas lead. Austin Ani as well, making quick decisions at the line of scrimmage in the read option offense and that offensive. That North Texas has a win over already this season. A week one win, 31 to 13, and you just alluded to it in front of a sellout crowd at the Sun Bowl. This would be their first home win of the 2022 season. Texas Southern trying to take a chunk out of that lead prior to the halftime break. The ball popped out though, and the Mean Green electing, and they will actually get on top of it. It bounced around. It didn't look like North Texas even won in that football, but it finally landed. Forced and a fumble recovered. Mean Green with over a minute left to try and put more points on the board. 
Oscar Attaway trying to do it all himself on the first play of the drive. Gets North Texas. Ani back up to the line of scrimmage. Handoff straight up the middle and into the end zone. Oscar Attaway, second time tonight. He's into the end zone, and the Mean Green break the 40-point plateau. And that is a first half before the halftime break. And Oscar Attaway, and he's taking about four Tigers with him into the end zone. Hard to stop. Number 27, Oscar Attaway. Rattles off a 10-yard run like that to continue to move this, move the chains and continue this drive. This one complete, far side. Gums finds his way into the end zone. Varquez Gums with his first North Texas touchdown in the first score of the third quarter. Yeah, it doesn't get any easier than that. When you see the whole defense converge on that away, and then they get it going back the other way. North Texas with another score. And as you see there, you only need a couple extra inches. Body with the handoff and into the end zone. Goes Texas Southern. It's J Corey Howard cleaning his plate. And the Houston native finds Pater for the second time this season. 6 one two, 25, and it doesn't get any easier than that. You're an inch away from the goal line. Redshirt freshman out there the majority of the season is... Carroll with no timetable left. Gannell unloads this one underneath to Jamori Macklin. Big roll tomorrow in the opening matchup for Tampa Bay. Off balance throw. Gannell has it intercepted at the second level. Back out to the 20 yard line. Back to the ground with Landis. Landis with a hole and he's got a score. First touchdown of his North Texas career in the main green. Move it to 58 points on the night. They have been firing that thing since the first quarter, but look at that land is pretty much untouched. I look forward to seeing the next couple of games for the Mean Green. 39 yard attempt. It was a bobbled hold, but he got it down just in time. And just not allowing for the Tigers to steal any more momentum. One more carry. We'll get North Texas up over 600 yards of total offense. And that'll do it here from Apogee Stadium. 35 points in the second quarter, enough to propel the Mean Green to a big-time offensive output in their first non-conference win.